Hi, this is Zach Marshall, District Chef with Eurus Dining Services, and today we're going to fabricate a whole fluke. So this is a flatfish, um, pretty much exactly the same as flounder, just a different species. Uh, this is neo locally landed close to us. Uh, so the first thing you want to obviously do is make sure to have a clean dry board and a clean dry fish to make sure that the fish doesn't run away from you during fabrication. Uh, also, I find it a huge help to have a 10 inch thin fillet knife. Uh, this is a Dexter brand, but you can pick any, you know, pick them up for about 15 bucks in any local knife shop. So, uh, first thing we're going to do for this is there is a line that goes right down the middle of this fish. We're going to have four fillets that come off of this. One through here, one on the other side, and then when we flip it over, we're going to have two on each side over here as well. So, that line that I pointed out is your guide. If you follow that line, it brings you right down the backbone. So, follow that down, and you just want to kind of wiggle your knife up under that and just let your knife do the work it knows where to go it's just going to follow the bones and goes right against this backbone and the spines of this fish so very easy just get along that bone and let your knife do all the work Here, we have a skin-on fluke fillet for one side. Next, we'll take off this other side. So once again, go right along this backbone, right up and under, from tail to head. So, here we have one side of the fillets. Next thing we want to do is just flip this over. Tackle the other side. So once again, we see this seam here. We're just going to follow that right down the middle of the fish. All the way to the tail. A little bit of scales on that. We'll just make sure none stay on the flesh for service. We will be skinning this fish. Popular application for this is um, to be deep fried or poached, rolled and poached in some form of a court bouillon. So once again we're just kind of walking our knife up and under this fish. So take that leg right off. One thing about a fillet knife that comes in quite handy is the fact that uh, you have nice bend on your knife. You definitely want that in order to stay close to the bone and easily get up and under the flesh of the fish. said they're very cheap and it is well worth the investment. So this is not a very fatty fish and it is really good to use up in your stocks and your sauces. So obviously you won't use some of the guts. You can cut the head right off. I like to use just the tail portion of it whatever I may be using. Clean that right off. And so 
Next, we're going to just take the skin right off of this. So we're going to start at the back of this fish. You want to bring it close to the edge of your cutting board so you can get a good start. You just want to kind of walk your knife right up and under. Keep a real good grip on the back of the skin here. Skin will just come right off. And here, we have a nice fluke fillet. So we're just going to do that to the other three sides, and that's pretty much it. That's how you fabricate a whole fluke or flounder. All general flatfish are pretty much the same. Thank you very much.